Hello, it's time for more Kirby, but first... A nap. Did you know that there's like eight separate animations for this? Including this one where Kirby falls off the bed. Oh, Hoon's at the end of the bed, like a little puppy or something. Very cute. God, that pillow looks so fuzzy, also. What a good Kirby game. It's got a Kirby and it's cute. That's all you need. Um, and also before I go to the psychic dream of an evil entity's thoughts about islands or whatever. The little ball has a cute Kirby face on it, thanks. I'm going to try tilt controls again. The most villainous thing. It does have a little cute Kirby face on it. This is the real challenge of the game, after all. Wait a minute. I could just go this way the whole time. Yep. Yep. Why did I try to go down the scary way? Every time. Tilt and roll Kirby one. Now it gets worse. You're pretty good at this game, Kirby. I've added a new difficulty for you. Give it a try. That was like three different voices. Wait. Oh no! Loathsome. Heinous. Why would you do this, Waddleby? What could possibly motivate you to do something so criminal? Uh. I guess it's fine, though. I've conquered your evil scheme. Is there gonna be like three total? You're pretty good, I've added a new difficulty. Well, this looks scary, also. Super Kirby Ball. Well, hmm, there's probably like a figurine or something that you get for doing this. If I had to guess, like maybe a figurine of the little Kirby orb. Ah, close. It is kind of fun. This reminds me of like the Breath of the Wild tilt control things that were also difficult. Yeah. Dang. Dang. I wonder how you can- I wonder how Kirby Tilt and Tumble for the Game Boy Color emulates. Like, surely there's some way to kind of emulate it? 
Let's not be here all day, though. I don't feel like that's gonna be worth it. Also, there's probably hidden, like, funny codes around town to find. And I wonder where those are, because I haven't found any of them, really. Well, there's something. Killed. I can find plenty of random coin. We found some of the soul. Okay, you don't have an opinion on some of the soul being found. Oh yeah, I forgot you can go back to the starting area. I wonder if that does anything to do that. Probably not. Probably no reason for that. Hmm, but where would a funny code be hiding? A little code for some prizes. Oh no, I'm sorry! Oh no, I've killed two of them! You can fall in Kirby's chimney. <laughs> Apparently. Alright. Well... I know that... Yeah, I know. I know there's present codes hiding all over town, Elphalyn. That's what I'm looking for. But I got no idea where to look. Because I... I, I... I just don't know. Where would you hide a present code? Where would such a thing be? Hmm. We've seen this dialogue. Meta Knight is very strong and cool. I've already tried all of the Colosseum battles that are available. Hmm. I'm expecting present codes to be, like, scrawled on walls or something somewhere. Like the Meta Knight one is the only one I think I found. But I'm not sure where to look. I'm sure we'll find out eventually. Someone will probably tell me. Meta Knight Sword. There's probably a ton of figures I'm missing also. I'm sorry, I've destroyed a Waddle Dee again. We're premiering a new movie. You probably have a lot of movies by this point. I haven't been in here since it happened.
But there's still more. Could there be present codes inside of building? There's a strange message in this pamphlet. Kirby story. This must be the hidden present code. Hey, okay, so Elflin calls to calls for your attention when you see one. So we found one. Hey, it's only been 10 minutes already without even entering the level. Kirby story. So, um, this might be sudden, and it is sudden. But it turns out that, again, I accidentally stopped the recording, and I uh, kind of missed this entire level. So, there is a feature of Windows, apparently, that can't be disabled with this recording software. We're pressing the space bar in an application will accidentally... Well, the intention is for it to be on purpose. Pressing the space bar in an application will repeat the last action or something like that. And since the last action was start recording and the button is shared for stop recording, it just kind of, uh, whenever the cord of my controller accidentally touches the keyboard, because I set it down for a second or whatever, um, the whole thing just stops. So I have to play this whole level again. On the bright side, I just noticed that it looks like it says got all pie because of my positioning on the screen. Good job getting all the pie, Kirby. Uh, I guess we're playing this entire level again. I got everything on the first try. I don't know if I'll get everything again immediately. Pretend this isn't happening. Look away. I mean, you know what it is. You can tell. But, uh, yeah, let's go through this again. It is what you think it is. It's the, uh, the second world again as a level. We can still see all of the souls. We'll be told we got all of them. God dang it. But we got to get all of them again, or at least make uh, an attempt at getting most of them or something. I'm not sure if enemies do more damage in this world or anything, by the way. But I was having... I am... I was struggling to survive a bit. There was also a point where I had to die because there's one that is missable in a way that requires you to reset if you don't get it. But it, it's a reset that works with death, so at least that's something, I guess. Again, it's like one of the small problems with this game sometimes, though overall it's an excellent game. I also kind of think like the mini bosses have new behaviors now, maybe? Sometimes? I don't know if we'll see it this time around. I also could be wrong. Guess we won't be seeing it. That's fair. I think that was all the souls in this area. I'm not going to be counting, so if I actually don't pick up ones that I already got, that's that's a mistake. At least I know that it's like the fault of Windows, which is oh, I, I, you need Ranger in this one. Mm. 
There's various targets to shoot, you see. There's this here. The whirlpools will hurt you. I don't remember these whirlpools existing before, or maybe I just didn't fall into any of them. There's a target over there. Boop. Wait, that's a rare stone? Did I miss that one? I think I missed that one. Well, that's fine. I mean, obviously I missed it because I didn't get the rare stone before. I think I only saw this one. Well, hey, it was worth playing the level again after all. There's a, uh, there was a target back there. That's another thing. And there's a target back here. It's pretty easy to hit a target when your projectile is a gigantic laser orb, I suppose. And there's three, and I think there was like one other one over here somewhere. Yeah. That's also the last one I got the first time through. You'll have to take my word for it. My several words. This is a part where I accidentally got hit frequently. I think in general in this level you don't really need... ...specific power-ups too much except for ice at the start. But it's always good to have ice. I was telling myself I have to be careful, but I was failing in doing that. Like that, actually. So it's a good recreation of what you missed. I'm just being catastrophically foolish. A lot. But at least there's donuts, and by that I mean ha, ha joke about that's not really a donut. Yeah, I got hit by that boulder before too. This boulder room... I struggle with it for some reason. There's a boulder here. I'm surprised I didn't get hit there. Then there's this little passage over here. Which I... Okay, this is souls. Soul pieces. I keep just calling them souls, but they're not. I've just now realized you can slide out of the ice guard. So you can still sort of dodge... ...with ice. Which is, like, good to figure out, but I probably should have realized that sooner. Then we have this part. I'm probably going to die. That puts the soul there. And there's one here. I don't think there's anything over here. I think this is just here. There were, of course, some, like, soul piece having enemies about in at least some parts that you won't be able to see. Because those don't reset. This is the room where you can, uh, lose one, I think. Or maybe not this room specifically, but, like, I think it's the next room, actually.
Yeah, and there's some under here. Yeah, it's the next whirlpool area. Oh, you can guard in the water, I guess, with ice. I think it's this one. Yeah, this switch makes one fall into the water. And it gets sucked towards the whirlpool, and if you don't catch it, it'll go down the whirlpool and disappear. And that's... I had to destroy Kirby in order to get that. Since I missed it the first time. And then this part, which I don't really remember from actual level. Okay, this is funny. I can just do this. This is helpful. These, I suppose, would be missable also, but I think there is a retry point at the end of this segment. Then you put this over here. I mean, this does go a lot faster the second time around. At least there's that. You gotta hit the fans. I almost missed that one. Oh, at least they have a generous hitbox, I guess. And then you have to remember that mouthful mode cannot swim, so you have to you have to jump out of that and go over here. And that's all of them except for the boss fight ones, which are through this way. I fought the boss with hammer, as you might have guessed from the start of this little portion of the video, I guess. But uh yeah. I guess it's ice time again. Illusory Fronds, Phantom Tropic Woods. You already knew what the boss was, probably. There's a fun thing about Hammer that I did here that was uh, mentioned in a comment, I believe. Where if you dodge a... Uh, if you dodge an attack with a hammer and do the dodge counter thing, the hammer does have a special thing for that, where it automatically skips to a later... It automatically, like, charges up a little bit. It doesn't charge up all the way, but it gets a little bit of charge, which is very helpful. Now there's a funny maze, I think. Yeah. Last time I didn't get through the maze. Tropic Woods is oddly vulnerable to freeze. Very vulnerable. I mean, ice. Freeze is a... Uh... Well, freeze is a status condition, I suppose. But yeah, that was this level. Sorry this wasn't quite a blind playthrough of it. But I guess then again it wasn't really in the first place either, because these are worlds in review of sorts. Got all pie! Love to get all the pie.
Alright, so... Yeah, I'll have to edit this together. 98 out of who knows how many. But next time... The Psychic Dream World Review of the Circus. Wait. Oh, for a second I thought one of the funny egg dogs had evil eyebrows, but it's actually just the little eyelash marks. I think it would be funny if the dogs in this version of the world were evil for no reason. Anyway, thank you for watching. This is a weird one due to technical error, but I think I figured out how to not have that problem. Except I'll probably forget about how to do that and then have it anyway. So, you know, Kirby. Kirby's still good, so it's okay.